There are two words in the English language that you should never say together in sequence. And those words are the and juice. <laughs> of course he went there. Because that's Dave Chappelle coming right out of the gate with it on SNL. He tackled the Kanye topic head on. A lot of people have issues, though, with how he tackled it, in that it felt like he was embracing some of the anti-Semitic tropes that Kanye has put out there. Well, I've been to Hollywood. It's a lot of juice. <laughs> but that didn't mean anything. You know what I mean? There's a lot of black people in Ferguson, Missouri. That mean we run the place. <laughs> Funny. Can we not say that's funny? The central premise of his set was what Kyrie and Kanye said about Jews is true. You just don't say it. You could maybe adopt the delusion that the Jews run show business. It's not a crazy thing to think. But it's a crazy thing to say out loud in a kind of like this. He, he, he's giving oxygen to this trope. Jews run the banks, Jews run Hollywood. Uh, what about blonde haired people running Hollywood? There's a reason you're saying Jew. It's drawing a conclusion that is anti Semitic. And by the way, there, there are a lot of Jews in this room, not a single blonde, though. Would you? <laughs> and speaking of things you're not supposed to say out loud, everyone thinks something that you shouldn't say. If somebody is thinking about not liking black people, it still makes them racist. I know, but the people who say it and act on it are worse. Maybe they're worse, but if you think the other, why is that not anti-Semitic? The ADL has come out and, and said that Dave embraced those same anti-Semitic tropes, even though he was making jokes. He said, as soon as he got on stage, he said, my job is getting so much harder. I hope they don't take anything away from me. It is a tough line to walk. <laughs> Whoever they are. But did Dave just cross it?